Welcome to the Crazy Hat Chemist. So today we're doing another video in gases. Bam! Today we're talking about a soccer ball. You see that picture of a soccer ball right there? The regulation FIFA soccer ball must conform to the following in order to fit within regulations. One, it must be spherical. Two, it must be made of suitable material. Three, the circumference must be between 68.0 and 70.0 centimeters. The mass must be between 410 and 450 grams, and the pressure must be between 0.6 and 1.1 atmospheres. So, a FIFA soccer ball was pumped to pressure when it was 28.1 degrees Celsius the day before a World Cup playoff in Italy. At that time, the ball had a circumference of 68 centimeters. Is the soccer ball still within regulations if the next day, at 8 a.m., the temperature at the time is 18.3 degrees Celsius? Good question. All right, so we are using the combined or the general gas law. And what is being held constant here? What's being held constant is pressure. Okay, so I'm going to get rid of the pressure here out of this equation and rearrange that. Okay, and what is being held constant? Again, pressure. So as the pressure goes uh, is held constant, then the volume goes up, temperature goes up, or the volume goes down and the temperature goes down. And in this case, the temperature is going down. So I would expect that the volume would decrease. Okay, so circumference is equal to 2 pi r. What we're going to do is solve for r. So I've rearranged this uh, circumference equation to solve for r. So I've got radius is equal to circumference divided by 2 pi. I'm going to plug in 68 for the circumference and 2 pi in for the 2 pi and get a number of 10.8 centimeters for the radius that's at regulation size originally. Okay, the volume that's m the minimum volume that must be had, and this is the volume of a sphere, that is 4 thirds pi r cubed is the volume for a sp sphere. I'm going to plug in the radius into this. Okay, and then from this, I'm going to solve for the volume that's necessary, the minimum volume that's required. And that vin minimum volume that's required is 5,270 cubic centimeters. Okay, I'm going to use the uh, equation right there in the upper right hand corner that you see, which is the Charles Law equation that is holding the pressure constant. Okay, and I'm going to solve, and I got the minimum volume, the temperature, the volume 2, and the temperature 2. And I'm going to plug right in here, and I'm going to solve for V2 here, which is my other volume at that cold temperature. So I have the two temperature values, and what's critical here is that you put those temperatures in Kelvin because degrees Celsius will not work. So I'm going to solve for that other V2. So that volume 2 is a 5,099 cubic centimeters. So the question is, is this regulation size or not? Okay, and the answer is no, this is not at regulation size because the minimum volume that I have to have is 5,270 centimeters. That would give me that circumference of 68 centimeters. And right now the circumference is not 68 centimeters since the volume is smaller. That is, the temperature went down and the volume went down. Perfect. So that means that that ball needed to be pumped up higher to a higher pressure to have a higher volume in, in order for it to have the certain amount of or the regulation size volume in order to play at that cooler temperature. Okay, that was another crazy video and Chloe, thank you very much for the dinosaur hat. Roar! Give me a thumbs up if you like that video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I love you and I'll see you next time. Bye now.